Uh, w- one of the big things, and, and I've got to uh, say that I do some editing work for this guy, not that we're like friends or whatever, it's just a bit of uh, editing work on the side. Uh, Conan, <clears throat> I edit for his YouTube channel. Uh, every time a video is uploaded of him talking, there's at least 10 comments within the art. What happened with Sean Oliver and Conan? And I tried to Google the story, and there's nothing really, there's no, like, facts coming up. It's just Reddit shit. So, Sean, what is the truth about the uh, the hate with Conan? Well, the best place to get the story is, of course, in my book, Kayfabe Stories You're Not Supposed to Hear from a Pro Wrestling Production Company owner, available on Amazon, um, or the audio version on Audible. Um, he was booked. He was booked. He took a $500 deposit, and he never got on a plane. That's the short of it. He was booked once. He had to cancel it. It was us and a a, a convention. We both booked him together, and uh, he called and said, oh, "I have a, a match in Mexico." And we're like, "All right, just come out six months from now." He said, "All right, no problem." Came out. Six, uh, we, he was set to come out six months from then. Uh, stopped answering his phone uh, for James, the convention guy, and uh, James sent someone to the airport because he bought the plane ticket and the, had the deposit money. And they took fan money for advances on autographs. And he just never got on the plane, never returned a call, never, never called back. He just he just robbed them, robbed us, robbed the fans. It's a purse snatch. It's nothing clever. It's just it's a fucking ghetto purse snatch. You know? And he, he won't. I've, I've tried to interview him for about six or seven months now. And even though I've helped throw out his podcast to millions, he won't do me a favor. So uh, I'm taking Sean Oliver's side because it's an Irish thing. But, okay. Oh, he's not Irish? Uh, well, his surname is O'Brien. Oh, right. That's what I thought. Charles yeah. O'Brien, right? Uh, no, I was going for Conan O'Brien. I'm not funny. It's oh, that's right. Different. You see, that's very good. You see, it's very, it's later over there, so I'm surprised you've got the wherewithal to, to do jokes. May I ask one favor just before you go? Is this a Batista's dick uh, thing? <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, uh, as I mentioned earlier, I do some work for Conan. But he refuses to do this podcast just out of spite. So anytime I have a guest on, whether it's from wrestling or comedy or anything, uh, I uh, ask them to record a quick message to him to try to somehow convince him to come on to do this. So uh, would you mind doing one? Um, You know what? I would normally uh, try to... Uh, convince him, but I do not in any way believe in the afterlife, so I cannot speak to the dead. That's, that's the answer I thought was going to happen. 